Okay, so you can use ChatGPT to help guide you what you're trying to do by letting it see your screen. So what I do is I have my list of uh, experts on the side. So let's go into Video Editor Vic and turn on the video feature. And hey Vic, um, I'm going to ask you to help guide me through CapCut because I don't know how to use it. So I'm going to go ahead now and uh, share my screen. So I'm going to share my screen and then start broadcast. Now you gotta wait for it to turn on. It usually takes a bit of time. And then once it starts going, now you're in. So, uh, hey Vic, so I'm gonna now share my screen. So I'm gonna go to CapCut and uh, hopefully you can help me uh, navigate. So here I'm in. So you can talk me through how do I um, start a new project? Sure, I'm happy to help. So from what I can see, you're on the CapCut home screen. Uh, to start a new project, just tap on that new project button right in the center. That'll let you pick the video clips or photos you want to include. Uh, let me know if you need help with anything else once you're in there. All right, so now I'm here. Uh, let's start with, uh, let's pick a video here. My kid's playing around with boxing. So One, two, three. Now what? I'll hit add. Now what do I do? Awesome. Now that you've added the video, you'll see the timeline at the bottom of the screen. You can tap on the video clip there to open up editing options like trimming, splitting, or adding effects. Uh, if you want to add text, music, or transitions, you so can use show the tool. Me, I'm going to interrupt you. Show me how to add text. Sure. To add text, look at the bottom toolbar and find the text option. Uh, once you tap on that, you can select Add Text, type in whatever you want, and then customize.